Good morning, everybody. Welcome to my creative time with Emma. And also welcome to our third and final day of our sneaky peeks for the 72nd edition release. I am super excited because I have such a cute um, sneaky peek to show you today. I have um, been getting requests for this since last year. Um, I was kind of holding off of it because I wasn't quite sure <laughs> what to do with this one. And then I finally been working on it little by little for a while now. And I just kept putting it on the back burner, putting it on the back burner until I felt it was perfect. So I'm super excited that we're finally coming out with this. Um, this one is called a Sloth Holiday. And I'm super excited because remember the freebie dies that we actually showcased yesterday? The fonts in this um, in this new set, all not the fonts, I should say the sentiments. Not every single one of them, but a lot of the sentiments fit in here as well. Perfectly along with the gingerbread friends that we showcased yesterday. So I, I super love that, that we're able to use that with just with two of the sets. And if you have any other sentiments, obviously you could use it with that. But I just love that it... it Actually, you could work with two of our new sets this time around. Um, <clears throat> and then, let's see. For this set, we have a total of... There are 21 stamps in here. And I will quickly show you the dies. And there are a total of six dies. Okay. So, um, as you will see on my blog, there are two different sloths. One is hanging on a candy cane, which is super duper adorable. Um, and then we have a little holly die, and the other sloth is hanging from a little wood branch. And it comes with, of course, you know, I love hearts. So I had to uh, add three hearts in there. And the funny thing, I'm just looking at my card, I thought I added it. The hearts and I didn't, but it's okay. Um, so anyways, this here is not a die. This is just basically a cut out um, right there. So these are the dies that go with that set. So I'm going to show you my cutie patootie card. Well, before I show you the card, the set I actually used with my card today, and this is an existing set I have out already, which is called The Adventure Begins, and I use those little balloons, okay? So here goes my card right here. Happy belated birthday. I love the way this came out. Now what I did was <laughs> I actually made an error on here because I'm not sure if you could see how the sloth's face is a little shimmery. I'm not sure if you, if it even shows up in the camera or not, but I was trying to, I used my little Zig uh, Clean Color Real Brush Markers for this, of course, because those you know those are my favorite, favorite uh, markers, um, and I colored it onto uh, water paper, okay? But I tried to go grab my water brush, but instead I used my Wink of Stella, and I was, I thought I was using my water brush to wet it, and I was like, oh my god, I, I, I just did it with the Wink of Stella, so... In order to keep it even, so it doesn't look like this face, face is just glowing, I actually did the entire body and the little branch and the balloons. I end up just going, just sticking with it. I figure, you know, I did not want to throw it away because I do not like wasting paper. So I have to salvage it one way or another. And I actually really like the way it came out. It kind of gives it a little something extra. Um, so what I did was I colored it in with my Zig markers. I just basically just kind of added the balloons on top um, added glossy accents to the eyes and the cutie patootie little nose and then that's one of the sentiments happy belated birthday and here goes the freebie dies right here and I love these because the these dies they're flat I have some other ones kind of similar to this but they kind of they're not flat like these and I love these for that reason because you don't have to pop it up you just put it straight down onto the card and you can mail it off like that it doesn't have, you don't have to worry about being you know what I'm saying like any height in it or anything um so that's about it and I use my little um I believe my stitch cartoon clouds to make the background so basically how I do it and I'll do a video on how I do my clouds somebody asked me before and I literally forgot so I apologize for that so basically what I do is I just cut you could cut all three of them out, but of course I could. I only found one of them. So I cut one of the clouds out. And basically what I do is first I just take my little 
this right here and I grab the ink uh, tumbled glass and first I distress all the edges now as, as you could see I grabbed the wrong sponge at first I grabbed the yellow one so you can see a little bit of yellow in there so it's like I said I didn't want to throw it out so I just kind of did a little bit more heavier on the blue um I do the edges first and then what I do is I put this down and then I just kind of like do like that go upward and outward and then I just keep doing it all the way down, just basically sporadically. And then I just kind of go over the whole thing really lightly. You could keep the uh, clouds like bright white if you want. But I just think it just kind of gives it a finished look. And I really love the way it came out. A very super simple card um, that does have some coloring in it. But I love it, okay? Um, so that is it. Now this set, just so you'll know, there's a little bit of everything in here. There's a birthday, there's some Christmas, there's even a Valentine sentiment in here, which I super love and I cannot wait to use that when heart day comes along. Um, so it has a good variety of sentiments. So I really, really love this set and I think you could use it for a lot. Um, so it's not just based around Christmas. So just so you'll know. So again, that is it, everyone. Um, don't forget to visit my blog at www.creativetimeforme.com to see what the rest of my amazing team has for you today. Um, and also, uh, don't forget to leave your comments on all of our blogs to see for a chance to win this brand new stamp and die set now also i kind of wanted to throw this out there when you leave your comments on our blogs please please leave an email and um, because random.org chose a couple of people and the thing is that i there's no email so i figure you know i'm just going to click on their name but then when i click on their name it's like anonymous so there's no way for me to get in touch with them so i have to move on and pick someone else so please leave a way for us to contact you um like i said just do your email and if you don't feel comfortable about leaving your email just kind of put like saying for example if it's like um judy at gmail.com just put judy then um you could spell out at and then spell out dot com so this way if you don't want to just put your you know the um the actual symbol and the dot i mean just to kind of switch it up so if you don't feel comfortable doing it the other way that'll be great it's just that you're losing out on winning and i don't want that for you um so just please leave a way for us to contact you when you leave your comments on our blogs okay um and that's it and also don't forget to see if you were the lucky winner of yesterday sneaky peek which was my favorite gingerbread friends um and that is it, everyone. That is it. That's a wrap for our sneaky peeks. Um, don't forget to join us tomorrow. So basically, everything we showcased here these last three days will be available for purchase starting tomorrow morning, which is October 20th at 8 a.m. Pacific Standard Time. That's when everything will be available for purchase. Um, the first 75 shoppers will get this awesome awesome gingerbread banner die set for free that's for the only for the first 75 shoppers okay if you were to miss out if you miss out on that window of opportunity um if you see this available in the store for purchase that means you missed out you missed the window but it will be available for purchase once the 75 shoppers come through and keep in mind this is not included with the um i know i probably sound like a broken record <laughs> saying this every single month but it's not included with the bundle because i always get people who said i ordered the whole bundle and that die was not in there or that freebie whatever we were offering was not in there that's why i was trying to make an appointment to say that this is separate it's separate from the bundle it's not included okay um oh and don't forget to use the code oh what is the code october 2017 so basically it's going to be abbreviated and it's all capital letters oct 2017 you're going to use that code at checkout tomorrow um to get your discount off of your entire in stock only purchase now keep in mind if I were to sell out of any of the new items, I will make that available for pre-order, okay? Um, so this way you won't you won't be able, so this way you won't miss out on the sale price, okay, everybody? So I think I covered everything, and then a huge, huge thank you to Miss, the talented Miss 
uh, Janice, who joined us this week for our sneaky peeks. I think she knocked it out of the park. So I'm so I'm so proud of her. She did a great job. So she will be joining us also for tomorrow um, for the blog hop. Okay, everybody. So don't forget, stop at my blog at 8 a.m. Pacific Standard Time. After you could go before, you could go after you shop, and you might want to stop there first just to see if you were the winner of this before. If you really like this set. And you might want to stop by to see if you won this set first before you order it. Okay, um, and then that's, and then the blog hop will begin on my blog. So if you want even that much more inspiration on all everything we showcased here this week, definitely hop along with us. And don't forget to leave your comments for a chance to win a $50 gift card to my store. And I will announce that window next Wednesday or Thursday. Okay, everybody. So again, thank you so, so much for joining us this week. Have a fabulous day and we will see you all back here tomorrow morning at 8 a.m. Pacific Standard Time. Bye-bye.